Put that arm, arm back. That's okay. I'm okay with that. You okay with that? I'm good. And we're back. <laughs> here I am, Fly Navarro with Fly Zone Fishing here with Jack from Black Bart Lures. We're sizing it up a little bit. We're sizing it up. You know, a lot of people come in and ask, what do I need to get? I've laid out the, the light tackle spread, the everyday going out. A lot of people run to the Bahamas. Sometimes you're, you know, maybe you want to try to catch a billfish. You want to try to catch a tuna or any, any of those larger species. The best method is always play it safe, vary your sizes. Because like everybody, we're just trying to get the rod to bend. Exactly. You know, I'm not necessarily trying to catch the biggest blue marlin. I'm just trying to get the rod to bend. Speak for yourself, man. I'm always trying to catch the biggest blue marlin. But anyway. <laughs> but, but if you look at this, again, you know, we look at, just like in the light tackle spread, all we've done is upped our sizes. We've used larger angle face lures in our short positions. We've used a little more passive baits out of our riggers. And then again in the center, we use a little jetted lure, which is, is that's your last shot. That's your last hope. The thing about our, uh, angle face lures is they're aggressive swimmers. So just like the kitty cat Gary talked about, when those fish come up on this, their eyes are over here. They're not here. They miss all the time. So a real aggressive bait will sometimes cause a wild strike. But if you put passive lures into your longer, uh, like, rigger positions, a fish coming in and making a turn, the first thing it sees is this easy target. And their prey drive's already fired up. So it makes it a very easy bait to catch. By varying your sizes like this, you, again, could fish a spread anywhere in the world. We just fished it in Costa Rica two weeks ago and, and did awesome with it. These, th and all you do is, on your big fish, you just up the game. Bigger baits. That's it. Nothing That's it. to it. Follow this spread. Usually angle short, passives in your rigger, and always a jet in your center if you run a fifth. That's Easy usually, peasy. That's usually your lucky spot right there. <laughs> no doubt. Thanks for joining us here in the Fly Zone.